Everybody loves candy. So, Candice. Oh, call me Candy. Candy, right. Because everybody loves candy. <laughs> right. Listen, uh, Candy, I was noticing here on your resume that you have a lot of night school and a lot of massage therapy classes. So why do you think you'd work out here? Um, I'm really good at, like, setting my mind on stuff. So would you say you're a self-starter? What? Oh, totally. Sometimes I don't even use an alarm clock in the morning. Like, I'll just wake up and start the day. So what are your career goals, Candy? Well, I love animals. I love my dog, Rocco. He's my baby. He's a mini teacup schnauzer wawa doodle, and he's my baby, and he fits in my pocket. Other than that, um, my ultimate goal is to become a dental hygienist, and then my other ultimate goal is to become a model. I actually did some print work in the fall. If you bought a Halloween costume bag, I was probably on it. <laughs> Sexy witch. <laughs> <laughs> well, you certainly are a colorful personality. Oh, no, but I'm not racist at all. Yeah. Uh, so do you have any piercings or any tattoos? Because you'd have to cover them up. Oh, I have like a real unique special one on my lower back. It's the Chinese character for... Wait, no. It's the Japanese... It's the Asian character for Cutie Pie. And it's surrounded by um, barbed wire because like I'm kind of tough. And then there's dolphins around it because I really truly just believe in animals. And then um, there's yin yangs around it because sometimes life is just black and white, like, like an Oreo or a dog. Right, you know, you'd have to keep your hair up and out of your face. So do you think you could do that with your hair? Oh yeah, actually I normally have in hair extensions, but they're the good kind. They're the kind they're made from like, children's hair or something. Great, Candace. Candy. Candy, right. Yeah. Listen, Candy, um, you know, we're a team here at this company. We work together. There's a lot of synergy, go-getters. Um, I always ask this question of my interviewees. Uh, what is your greatest weakness? Um, I'm, I'm not really good at, like, reading. Wow. <sighs> I didn't expect that one. <laughs> uh, uh, well, I appreciate your honesty. Uh, why don't we move on to the last question? I always ask this of my candidates. Candidates, do you get it? You said my name in the word, <laughs> candidate. Why don't we just move on, Candy? Uh, you know, this is a very important question I ask my candidates. What is your greatest strength? Um, probably shopping. So how does that qualify you to be a programmer? Well, I think I'd make a really good pre-game or... Oh my god, you said programming and I thought you said pre-gaming? I totally read the ad wrong. I told you I wasn't real good at reading. Oh my god, wait, oh. Speaking of pre-game, hold on a second. Amber, hey. Okay, I'm actually already kind of buzzed, so I'm just gonna meet you at the bar. Okay, TTYL, bye. Um, thanks for your time though, like I'll call you for something. Thank you.